Now we will discuss about what are anthraquinone glycosides. Anthraquinone glycosides basically they are derivative of anthracene ring. Now this is anthracene ring and if you remember or if you uh, memorize this ring then this will be very easy for you to make uh, structures related to anthracene or anthraquinone glycosides. By the way this is the anthracene glycoside or anthraquinone glycoside these are two names for the same type of glycosides. Now here you can see the different derivative of anthracene and this is anthrone, this is anthroquinone and this is oxanthrone, this is anthranol and this is dianthrone. This is one anthracene structure, this is another anthracene structure and this is also called a dimer of anthracene. So these are the different properties of anthracene. Like anthracene is, a, is an aromatic organic compound and a derivative of anthracene. Anthranols, anthrones and dimer of anthrones are also derivative of anthracene. And they are chiefly found in dicot plant, but to some extent they are also present in monocord and lower plant. Anthrones are insoluble in alkali and they do not show strong fluorescence, while anthranols, which are soluble in alkali, show strong fluorescence. The reduced form of anthraquinone are more biologically active. Anthraquinone naturally found in aloe, senna, rhubarb, and cascara, although they are also present in fungi, lichens, and insects as well. Natural anthraquinone derivatives tend to have laxative effects and they are mostly used as laxative. The common A glycon are alumidine, amodine, rain, and chrysophenol. Sugar molecules present in anthraquinone glycosides are arabinose, raminose, and glucose. This bone fringer test this is a typical test which is used for this specific uh, type of glycosides, or uh, this is a class test of anthraquinone glycosides and which is very simple test you have to take 1 gram of drug then add 5 to 10 ml of dilute ACL boil it on water bath and for 10 minutes and filter it filter it was extracted with carbon tetrachloride and then add equal amount of ammonia solution and then filter it and shake it formation of pink or red color in ammonia layer due to the presence of anthraquinone moiety as you can see that this pink color represents the presence of anthraquinone glycosides now first example of anthraquinone glycoside is aloe and here is botanical name aloe vera, aloe pereiri, aloe barbidensis, aloe ferox, family liliaceae, part used dried exudation of the leaves. The main constituents present in aloe are barbiloin, beta barbiloin, isobarbiloin, resins and aloe amidin. And here you can see the structures of these compounds present in aloe. And this is glycoside alloin, while these are a glycone alloimidine, and this is also a glycoside which is called barbiloin. So aloe is used as laxative, as emollient, and it also has antibacterial activity, which is also used for uh, wounds, burns, and other skin disorders. The next example of anthraquinone glycoside is senna. Botanical name. Casea angustifolia, Casea senna, family leguminaceae and part used dry leaflets or pots. These are different chemical constituents which are present in senna leaf, senoside A and B, senoside C and D, amodine and aloamodine and rain. Here we can see the structure of different glycosides present in senna. This is the structure of senoside A or C. You can see here, if you replace R, R group with carboxyl group then this structure will become senoside A and if you replace this R group with uh, methyl hydroxyl group CH2OH group then it will become senoside C. And here if you replace this R group with carboxyl group then it becomes senoside B and if you remove this R group with CH2OH then it will become senoside D. Senna is used as purgative. So it increases the peristaltic movement of the colon by its action upon the intestinal wall. It is also used as expectorant. Uh, it is also useful in the loss of appetite. Leaves are also made into a paste and applied to various skin diseases. Rhubarb. Biological sources, Rame peltatum, Rame officinale, family polygonacy, part roots and rhizome. Rhubarb contain rhean and thrones. This is the structure of rhean and throne. And other compounds present in uh, rhubarb are rhein, chrysophenol, aloe amidine, and amidine. 
it reduces cholesterol level it is used as antiseptic agent anti tumor agent laxative agent purgative agent it is also used in liver and gallbladder complaints it is also used for the treatment of hemorrhoids and menstrual problems cascara bark biological source ramnus persiana family ramnus chemical constituents it contains cascarosoid a and b and cascarosoid c and d and this is the basic structure of cascarosoid and if you replace this r group with these functional groups then you can obtain cascarosoid a b c and d cascarosoid is a gentle laxative it restores the tone of the bowel muscles it is used for habitual constipation and it's also used for chronic constipation it also improves appetite it is also used for the treatment of hemorrhoids liver problems and jaundice